Bears just trying to keep everything underneath. This is underneath, but Cup gets about 10. That's right. Yeah, there's and, and still over a minute to play. So they marked him out just short of the first down. So second and one. Yeah, they're trying to they're trying to play two deep safeties, allow them to play a little bit tighter underneath, but the Rams have been able to get some easy yards. And now a false start. There won't be a 10 second runoff. The clock was stopped. False start. Offense. Number 79. Five yard penalty. Second down. That's the third false start this year for Havenstein. And the first false start of the night for the Rams in this loud Seattle home. Blitz off the edge, Rams pick it up, and Cup is out of bounds with a first down. Yeah, Seattle, they, they decide to, to bring the pressure. Gurley comes over and picks this up off the edge. A really good job on his part. From the 42 on first down, Goff throws, pass, caught, Everett. The ball comes out, and they're going to say Everett was down at the 30. And the Rams are already in field goal range. Here's the play. Touched, goes down, hits. They should maintain possession. Hey, Gerald Everett, he's had, a, he's had some suspect plays, but I think that was a good call by the officials. On first down. Incomplete. 24 seconds left. Right now, golf needs you know those outside breaking routes like that when it's tight coverage. We, we've seen opportunities for Seattle to make plays. They're they're in well within Zerline's range. He's got to be really smart with the football. Cannot take a sack. Certainly not put the ball in harm's way. It would be a 48 yard try from this spot. Pass is broken up. That's Taylor. He's been busy. Jamar Taylor as he got in front of Cooper Cup. Brings up third down. Yeah, they keep it. It's good. I mean, these are close contested balls. I mean, right now, I, I'm not so sure you don't just come back and, and give it to Gurley and, and and let him see what he can do and then trust Zerline to come through in the clutch for you. But, you know, throwing those passes, the risk that's involved, whether it's a sack or an interception, just isn't worth it. But they're out of timeouts. They'd have to hurry their field goal unit on. This is third down and 10. Play clock and one. And that's going to cost them five yards. Delay a game on the offense. Five yard penalty. Third down. And that just became a 53 yard field goal because of that. Again, this is third down. It's third down, you're right. And, the, and there's in 20 seconds, you should be able to get your team out there. I mean, they're ready to go, but depending on how much time is run, I mean. Golf throws, passes, caught. Everett out of bounds. He gets that yardage back plus some to the 26. And now the field goal unit will come on on fourth down. A gain of nine. And Gerald Everett putting a career high day together 136 receiving yards. There's the unit. McQuaid, Hecker, Zerline, Zerline from 44. Oh. 
Zerline missed it. Good snap, good hold. He just he just pushes it right ever so closely and just just misses it. And the miss on a 44-yard try for Zerline, who's had eight career game-winning kicks, including the 57-yard field goal at New Orleans that sent the Rams to Super Bowl 53. Misses wide right, and the Seahawks. Four and one.